Hey everyone, this is Derek J, and I am recording outside of Timoleon's Family Restaurant where a few activists and I enjoyed a delicious breakfast after the trial of Ian and Kelly for their criminal trespassing at Superior Court. Um, the trial happened at District Court. It was postponed uh, where there's going to be a hearing on something about the merits of the case and the constitutionality of a ban on uh, setting foot on the court property. It's uh, questionable whether or not the sheriff, who is part of the executive branch, is able to put a ban on someone from accessing the judicial branch, and whether or not the sheriff even knows the uh, tenants required uh, to be met before being able to ban someone. So, um, sort of a who's who of uh, activism here in New Hampshire. We've got uh, Mark Warden behind me, Oz, and uh, Kate, who does the police accountability report. A lot of people think that Daryl does the police accountability report, which is true, he does read it, but Kate is a lot of the brains behind the operation, and uh, you know she's been keeping up with a demo and uh, making sure that he's doing well while he's in jail, um, and she is in charge of like coplock.org while he's away right now, so not that anyone's in charge, it is a decentralized thing, but uh, she does a lot and uh, doesn't get all the recognition that she deserves, so I'd like to plug Kate Ager, she's one of the ladies in Keene and a blogger there. Um, and also does a podcast. So check out some of her work if you haven't done so already. Uh, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. Today is uh, September 17th. It's roughly noon and uh, I'll report back later this evening after I uh, appear on Shire TV. Peace.